welcome to the Barrel House. Actually, evening, afternoon, just welcome to the Barrel House. We are doing a single barrel Sunday slash bourbon talk. So not everything here is a single barrel. We are gonna feature a line of bourbons today. One of my absolute favorites, up and comer. A lot of you probably don't have this. It's a must have. You must get these bourbons. This one is one of my absolute favorites. These are amazing single barrels. We got a single barrel bourbon, a single barrel rye. What are they? Let's check it out. We've got, you saw my video, we've got Clyde Mays. 110 proof, six year, absolute caramel, apple, vanilla, bomb. Must have, all right? So we have next to it, Clyde Mays, single barrel bourbon, 102 proof aged five years. We have Clyde Mays single barrel rye. Let me get the label out there. There we go. Single barrel rye, 104 proof aged five years. All amazing bourbons. Clyde Mays is underrated. They're building a huge, uh, I think it's a hundred million dollar building in Alabama, right on the border. Clyde Mays is a war hero and bootlegger uh, at World War II, and his bourbon is, he was, the, he was the early bourbon. This stuff is just gaining ground. Their stuff is amazing. I also have, let me get back here, I have this little sampler pack of Clyde Mays that I found in Wyoming. Look for that hunt day video in Wyoming coming soon. But check this out, this is pretty cool. I wanna get all the lesser ones, I haven't bought these yet, the 93 proofs, but I love these. So we're doing the Clyde Maze line. It is a must have line. Uh, put it on a shelf in a glass, have it in your collection. You will not disappoint. This drinks like a hundred dollar bourbon. These two for single barrels, you can find them as store picks. They do quite a bit of it. They're only about $40. I have not had the rye, I just popped it open. So I haven't had that yet. I'm letting it breathe in behind. We've got our glasses in behind and uh, our one here. So let's go ahead and start with the one I did the short on, which I absolutely love as my favorite. It's gonna be better than the other two. It's more money. This is easy to get though. This is at pretty much most liquor stores. Pick this up. All right, here we go. I mean, it's just, it's apple. I mean, maybe even like a cinnamon apple, caramel apple, some vanilla notes. It's just got uh, some fruits in there, which would be like the dried apple. It starts smooth right away. You get fruits, you get, you know, you know like caramels and vanillas. I, I wouldn't say nuts and, um, and a little bit of oak, and then there's a little bit of a leather as it goes down, and it, it's just, it, it's it's very complex, very amazing, unique to a lot of, of your Kentucky bourbons and your Tennessee bourbons and whiskeys. This is a must have. All right, let's go to the single barrel, and we're gonna save the one I haven't had for last. We're gonna go to the single barrel bourbon, five year. So, um, you know what? Let me do a little whiskey wash here. Uh, with my other glass, get a little water. All right, I am doing this. This is right after, if you watch any videos in Wisconsin on my trip, this is the day after I finally got back, had a 14 hour day at work, and I am doing some bourbons because it's been insane. I had the plane trip from hell, everybody. Uh, I ended up, I started in Hayward, Wisconsin, went to Minneapolis, St. Paul, flying home to Colorado into DIA, ended up in Albuquerque, got my flight canceled. The next day my flight got canceled. I had to rent a car and drive from Albuquerque to Denver and get my car. That is a seven hour drive, then get my car, and then go to work today. It's been crazy. I'm drinking Clyde Mace. So here we go, here's a single barrel. So if I get a little nuts, sorry. Everybody also, uh, hopefully I'll get gear eventually. I hope you like the Barrel House logo. I had this hat on for a few videos, but I haven't talked about it, so hope you enjoy. All right, here we go. Yeah, this is a lot of the same notes. This is a little bit lighter and um, a little bit of apple and some dried fruit and um, not as leathery. This is actually gonna be 
It starts out with just a slight spice, which is crazy. Maybe a hair of heat, it's five years, but then it just smooths right out. And it's just like apple and vanilla. It's, it's just, it's so good. These are great bourbons, guys. Get these bourbons. All right, here we go. Let's try the rye. Oh, another whiskey wash. Bourbon wash, now we're going to whiskey. So here we go. Here's the rye. Oh, I get some spice up front. A little bit of spice, and I'm still getting kind of apple and uh, caramel now. Not as much vanilla. Oh, no, this is interesting. Oh, wow. Wow, that's pretty good. Okay, this is... I gotta try this one more time. That That is a great flavor. I'm getting apple forward and then goes right into kind of a, a spice. Yeah, it's a sweet apple and then like a peppery spice with a little bit of a, um, then maybe back to an apple finish. I wouldn't call it a lot of, I mean, there's some butterscotch. I'm definitely getting butterscotch now. Boy, that, that goes smooth. A little spice, apple. That's, yeah, that's like a, maybe there's cinnamon in there. Wouldn't call a lot of it. It's a, wow. That, that's pretty decent. I have not tried this. I just bought it because I found these two single barrels and I like rye. This is, this is a really good rye. This is unique to a lot of the rye. Yeah, this would be like a spiced apple cider whiskey punch but dry not not real sweet but it, it's got like that apple cidery spicy note like you're putting that cinnamon spice stick but it's not real cinnamony i'm getting a little bit of um yeah it's almost like a it's hard to explain i would just try it so there you go there's a little bit of corn in there definitely so i'm getting this spiced corn note uh just a sweet finish these are all incredible Get on Clyde Mays. Go get this bourbon and whiskey. It is absolutely fantastic. Please subscribe to my channel. Please hit that like button. It really helps. I'm trying hard. I hope you're enjoying the content. Please watch, please watch these videos. There will be another one coming out. Look for a sneak peek. Uh, make a comment below if you've made it this far into the video. I will be doing soon on another camping trip in a couple of weeks. Eagle Rare in the Outdoors, single barrel versus single barrel store pick versus Eagle Rare regular tenure two two store pick single barrels and an eagle rare regular tenure blind in the mountains soon hit the like button cheers everybody these have to be on your shelf these must be in a glass enjoy your weekend have a nice day